everyone, it's Froggina back again with another episode of Mystic Messenger. So we've got a new chat room called Just Like Rika. And I'm going to go ahead and start that up. Uh, Yusung, Jumin says that he'll give you a bottle of wine if you keep the cat. Hey, a seven. Here, let's talk to Yusung. Mila, you're here. Yeah, I saw it, but I don't really like wine. <laughs> you get a cat and a bottle of wine? Two birds with one stone. He won't give it to Seven. I'd feel bad for the kitten. You're not going to keep it anyways. Then I should. I can't afford to raise a cat since I'm not earning any money. There's nothing you can't do if you want it enough. I want to see you raise the cat. I'm going to raise you, Sung. No. No. Yeah. Why don't... You don't raise a cat with money. You do it with love. Mila, if you want me to raise the cat that bad, I'll think about it after the party. Haha, <laughs> I'll take good care of it until then and put it on track to becoming a long cat. Don't torture the cats. I don't torture. No way I can do something scary like that. I'm sure Jumin will take good care of the kitten. Is that so? Jumin will take good care of it for now. Yeah. You Sung, you're not playing games these days. I do play, but not as much as I used to. Right, Mila? Listen to this. Yesterday evening, I was playing games and I suddenly got this thought. Using good keyboards and a mouse is really important for games like... Lol, lol. Yeah, that's true. A keyboard and mouse is like every computer's user's hands and feet. Yep. You sung you're going to play games again? Uh, but what about it? What about it? So I was thinking... The feeling of the keyboard is really important to maximize the fun in the game. I found a company that develops keyboards for gamers who play for hours straight. It may seem a bit silly, but the more I look into it, the more I get the feeling that the company's really great. They even make USB-powered fans and heaters for gamers. I thought it'd be nice to invite them to the party. That's a great idea. Then I'll try to reach them. I'm glad to be of help. I feel like Yusung's changed completely in the past couple of days. It was easy to make fun of him when he, all he did was play games. I feel like that won't work anymore. He's so serious now. Time for you to let it go. I won't be so easy from now on. You like Mila, right? Yes. I'm blushing. I want to own Yusung. No. Enough of that. Oh, I'm blushing too. But I like it. <laughs> If you're about to make another joke, give it up. Don't you want to see each other face to face and get to know each other first? Of course. I'm sure Yu Sung will come for me later, haha. I'd love to meet him in person. Well, of course I want to meet him in person. Me too. <laughs> Mila, just wait a sec. I'm cringing. Before I can't stand to watch it, I need to ask Yu Sung a question. What question all of a sudden? I'm going to cast a spell to see whether or not your heart is true. I don't need that. You sung, yes? You imagine what Mila looks like right in your head, right? Yeah, I do. I did from the first day, to be honest. Don't you want to go somewhere and have fun with Mila, just the two of you? I've never thought about it, but that would be great. Do you think about Mila when you wake up in the morning? Yep. I check to see whether or not she's online. Do you think of her before you go to bed? Hmm, yes again. I check to see whether she's online or not. Blushing, do you have something against this seven? Um, blushing. <sighs> I feel like I'm about to die from all the cringing, but I have a couple more questions. You sung, yeah? Do you think Rika and Mila are similar? Hmm, yes, a little bit. In what way? Uh, they're both doing the same things for the RFA with the same goal. Is that all? Won't they look alike too? I can't say anything since I don't know what Rika looks like. Yu Sung is was Rika your type? We don't. Well, I mean, we know what she looks like, but this is this is wrong. It's cousins. You probably look like her. Hmm. I don't really think they look like each other. Maybe because you know what Mila looks like. <laughs> I'm just saying that's the feeling I get. They'll have different personalities, but I think they'll feel similar. You're just imagining whatever you want. Hmm, I'm not Rika, you sung. I'm, I'm not... I'm not her. I know, but... 
I just feel like you two are very similar. To me, at least. No. What? This is just as if... You can't tell the difference between a laptop and a computer. What? I can tell them apart. It's like you can't tell apart Long Cat from Nyan Cat. What are you saying? It's as if you can't tell LOL from LOLTA2. LOLTA2 isn't popular. Oh, Dota2. <laughs> How can I explain this so our boy Yusung understands? He can't really distinguish me from Rika. I can replace Rika if that's what you want, Yusung. No. Yes, that's it! I know they're two different people, but I'm sure that she's like Rika. And personally, I'm sure that Rika's the one who sent Mila to her apartment. Hmm. Only time will reveal that. You don't have to explain to me similarities and differences between Rika and Mila. I'm just beginning to understand my feelings towards Mila. Time will tell. Hmm, yes. I hope you two change your status of being single soon. Thanks for taking an interest anyways, Seven. We'll take care of it ourselves. Thank, thank you. Thank you, Seven. Haha, <laughs> I knew you'd be impressed with my noise. I knew you'd be impressed with my uh. nosiness. Uh, she was trying to put it nicely. Haha, <laughs> I should go work again. Slave for company. Cheer up, Seven. We'll talk later. Goodbye. Let's talk about something fun next time. Bye-bye. I have to leave, too. Mila, I know I've said this before, but... Thank you for staying in the organization. And thank you for always cheering and looking out for me. I'll work hard from now on. You sung you're like a puppy. Thank you for saying that. Thank you. I'm really happy when I'm with you. I have to go now. Have a good evening. You too. And... Rika Shadow. Jayhe, hello. Zen, how's your ankle? I don't give enough love to Jayhe. Hello, Mila. All right, all right. Hey, both of you. Zen, how's your ankle? I'm going to ask the hospital to take the cast off tomorrow. I won't go all out, but I want to start practicing again. Won't that make your ankle worse? Your passion is amazing. Isn't, isn't that going to make your ankle worse? I agree. I'm worried that will only worsen your injury. I recover like a monster, so it's fine. Nonetheless, taking the cast off after only two days. I heal fast, so it's fine. I already knew that, but I'm still worried. I heal like a monster. I can feel that it's almost better now. Heal like a monster? How manly. Huh? Really? Doesn't it seem a bit brutish? We actually had a meeting today with people in the film industry. Mr. Han signed a contract with the company that produced films about a man turning into a monster. Whoa! My company's famous. Wow, you're amazing, Jay He. You're not talking about the Hulky, are you? What, what is the Hulky? That's it. I really love that movie. Oh, the Hulk. I'm glad. It seems the Mr. Hans group is planning to join the film industry. Mr. Chairman is especially interested in film festivals. While looking for massive blockbusters like the one I mentioned, I came across films that are not famous but are deeply meaningful. And I was able to discover several films that I couldn't that couldn't compete in festivals despite the lack of funds. Despite that, the films were great quality. That's a shame. Yes. So, I got in contact with the film festival committee that aims to evaluate films based on their quality. I was wondering if we could invite them to the party. Sounds complicated. Of course, it depends on Mila's decision. I thought you were going to say that we should invite the production company, but the Fair Film Festival Committee. It's so you to make that decision. I tend to like organizations that do not aim for profit. What do you think, Mila? Let's invite them to the party. Woo! Glad to hear that. I'll contact them. I'm worried that Mila might feel pressured because of the schedule. But before that, you sung that boy. I'm not really sure if he has genuine feelings for Mila. I feel bad saying this in front of Mila, but... 
Yes, it might be rude. It's as if he's saying he likes Mila because she's similar to Rika. What do you think, Mila? I don't care who Yu Sung confuses me with as long as he becomes mine. I wish that he could see me for who I am. It's true. I feel that you have every right to think that. Yu Sung will soon realize what the truth is. Yes, but considering what's going on right now, when he actually gets to meet Mila, if she feels nothing like Rika, I'm worried that Yu Sung will have a mental breakdown or something. Do you think it'll be that bad? Yes. Since he liked Rika so much, I don't want Mila to get hurt by any chance. It is common to end up liking someone who is similar to the person you admire. I think it's possible to develop a deep relationship that way. If it's that kind of relationship, wouldn't someone get hurt in the end? What if Mila ends up getting hurt? I don't think I'll mind. You son will change. He'll figure it out. I think so as well. He will change in a good way. I'm just worried that Yu Sung will make a mistake, since he doesn't have much experience. If it's Mila, I, I can be a better... I can be a better escort than that little boy, you know. Not interested in you, and how will you escort me exactly? I'm interested in Yu Sung, sorry babe. Oh my god. Mila is interested in Yu Sung, you already know that. I was only kidding. Well, I'm too busy to go on dates anyway. I assume so. I think it's better for you to focus on your career. Jehe, you don't go on... Don't you go on dates? Maybe there's someone that you're seeing in secret? Yeah, I think she could. I think Jehe likes someone. Uh, maybe she could. Who knows? Right? Since Jehe's pretty, has a hot body, and plus the skills too, no such person exists. Hmm, I'll believe you for now. Anyways, I hope Yu Sung grows up and becomes the perfect man for Mila. Or else I'm just gonna snatch you away, haha. <laughs> Jokes like that make Mila feel uncomfortable, since women are not objects to be owned. My heart's already with Yu Sung. Yeah, I'm offended. My heart's with Yu Sung. That's good. I wish the best of luck to you two. A woman with a sincere heart is always so charming. I have to leave for a moment. Zen. Yes? Please take good care of your ankle and get better soon. Alright. Mila, are you going to stay here? I should go practice my lines. Uh, goodbye both of you. Get better soon, Zen. I'll have to go too. Bye both of you. Yes, Mila. Let's talk later. Goodbye. Bye. And... You. Um... It's amazing how much you managed to change him. I'm at the airport right now. The gorgeous night view will be waiting for me in China. I hope that I have the leisure to enjoy the view. Good luck preparing for the party. Oh, uh, thanks. Come, uh, I'll try practicing to be more calm. Come to think of it, you're the only one without emojis. We have them based on our faces. It's upsetting. You just want to see my face, right? You know it. What do we got? Anybody new? Dear RFA party representative. Uh, hello, I am the head of the keyboard research facility. All of our researchers were very surprised after being asked if we are interested in this party. We are currently pulling several all-nighters to develop keyboards of the gamers by the gamers for the gamers. Do you know what the most important factor in developing a comfortable keyboard is? Ergonomics, color. I'm gonna go ahead with ergonomics. Hello, I am Mila, RFA's party guest coordinator. I think it's ergonomics. I've read an article that said a curved keyboard is best for the human wrist. My wrist tends to hurt whenever I spend a long time typing. Crying face. Oops, you caught me. I just want to see your smile. Soon. Soon. 
All right, well, I'm going to go ahead and end this episode here for today. Hope you guys enjoyed it. If you want to see more videos from me, then don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.